What's up everyone and welcome or welcome back to my channel. Hello, how are you? In today's video we will be doing another chess review and we will be reviewing a game that I have played yesterday and I, I was actually filming myself while playing this game and I wanted to post this as my chess adventure series uh, but the problem was uh, this person has beaten me but that wasn't the biggest problem you know you know if you watch my videos that I lose very very frequently so that was not the problem but I got very very mad and I was just like Jesus I got so mad I was on the verge of crying and like losing my bits so I decided not to post that video and one hour after having a complete emotional breakdown after this game because this person was just making such moves that were just like what the hell this is not human one hour after play playing that game chess.com messaged me with hey this person that you played against that actually that broke you mentally and emotionally is actually a cheater a plain old cheater and they used an engine against me and that is how they managed to win because this person was the, pretty much the similar rating as I am and I was just like so shocked I was just like what the hell how are they so smart how do they know how to do this well they're the same rating as I am and I have no idea and I would have never thought of this and then I was just so relieved because one hour later I realized that this person actually used an engine against me and not just against me, against every single person that they played with, they used an engine. So this is, this is just a cheater and nothing else. So we'll be analyzing this game of mine as white against a cheater that was black. And let me just tell you, let me start my screen recording right now. And see you can as soon as we started this screen recording you can see that this cheater has accuracy of 96.2 dude he has accuracy of 96.2 in 600 rating sure man sure and I have accuracy of uh, 79.3 as you can see which is like pretty much okay so we will start the review now and of course the bot will be helping me what is happening slow down slow down okay the bot will be helping me and i'll be actually like cheating a little bit as well because i will actually be telling like what is a good move what is not based on this bot because by myself i i do not know you know if you know me if you've seen any of my videos you know that i do not know <laughs> so we will just start so First I played as white and I decided to uh, to do the London system again because actually that is pretty much uh, pretty pretty fun for me and I truly want to learn this. So I was just like yay I'm playing as white you know finally yay I can I can try to show off my skills that I have learned and I can try to practice them against somebody random you know yay But no this was a cheater. So next move they play d5 okay pretty much normal move you know everything uh is going so uh, well so far i took off my uh my bishop to what is this move f4 thank god for the bot because it would have taken me so much more time to read these notations without the bot but okay i made the book move starting my london system he plays what is this move um e e6 pretty much okay you know book move fine and then I took on my horse or knight however you want to call it he does the same on the same side and I took on my pawn to e3 and we're doing pretty much okay here for now you know he takes out his pawn to c5 and he here attacked my pawn here and what did I do I ignored it and you know what I noticed that I have a big problem in chess which is somebody's planning something here so I won't react you know because when I saw this maybe I mean it says here book move but actually why wouldn't I just eat this I should have just taken this you know uh, it's it's a I mean it's not a free pawn he would have taken out his bishop here but okay you know I was just like, 
fine, I will ignore it because I think always like, hmm, maybe this is their strategy because they're offering me this, they probably want me to take it so I won't take it because I won't be playing by their rules, blah 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 I really do not know if that's a good decision or not but we will see, like, um, actually I will see but you and with me as well after some time, after I develop some certain level of skill so, um, he moved this pawn that, uh, from c5 to c4 and it says this is excellent to me it's just like what the hell and then I did an excellent move of uh, putting my uh, horse to e5 because that's my whole plan with this London to put my horse here and to try to get as close to his king as possible, you know he took out his horse, attacking my horse, and then I took out this horse to, to connect my two horses and uh, to, to defend, of course, my, my horse that was attacked. And then he placed his queen to b6, and the bot here says that this is the best move. This develops a queen off its starting square, getting it into the action. I do not think that somebody who is rating of 612 would truly have thought of this and would truly be brave enough to take out their queen so early because I noticed that um, we 600 ratings, we, we, uh, we truly are, uh, how can I say this, we truly love our queens and uh, we either blunder it immediately, <laughs> some people truly do, or we don't take it out, I mean at least I don't, I don't take out my queen until I get everything other developed, you know, but fine, and here I make a blunder, you know, he makes an, the best possible move, because he's a cheater, and then I as a human being make an error, which is b3, which is a blunder, because he was attacking this pawn, and I just, I, I should have put in my queen, to to uh, C, what is this, C1, yeah, right here, wait, how can I retry, so wait, he, he, no, so he makes this, and I now, uh, I now click, aha, uh -huh, okay, so here, is that the best move, he's loading, yeah, so I should have put in my queen to c1, and the bot here says that that is the best possible move. But okay, I played a uh, b3 for some reason, because I'm a human, because I'm truly a beginner, not a cheater, and because I do not know what's happening. But fine, I, was, I think that I was still doing pretty well, but here the bot says that from pretty equal position, we are going to me completely losing you know, but if this person was truly rating of 612 and without an engine, do you think that they would have thought of this move? Do you think that they would have truly used their 100, actually 90% advantage here? No, because they're 600 rating just like me and they do not know some things just like me, you know, but look at this move, the next move is what? I was just like so shocked. And the bot here says, uh, bishop to b4 is a great move. Like what? He just, whoop, and gave me a check. Which is, you know, I thought like, okay, you know, it's not very hard to see where you have the check. So maybe that's okay. And then I put back my horse here, trying to defend my king and trying to get myself out of this bad position. But as you can see here, Balak is still winning like 90% and then he took this horse, I took him with my bishop and he makes another great move which is bishop, uh, sorry, knight to uh, e4 attacking here and here and everywhere and I was just like, okay, shaken up a little bit so I decided to completely ignore this because somebody's planning something and I did not know that I was playing against an engine, not a person, you know. If I knew that maybe I would have played better. 
But like this, I was just like, hmm, okay, it's a person there doing something, I do not care. Actually, this is a brilliant, not a brilliant, great move, but still, you know, I thought it was just like them doing something. They just jumped here, and I was like, okay, then I'm going to take this pawn, attack the, the rook, and maybe I, I can get myself out of this position. And then he takes my knight because he is offended by his knight here that he jumped with previously i cannot take this bishop with my queen with i mean i can take it with my queen but do i truly want to give my queen like that maybe i should have you know and while i was playing this i was uh, on the camera as well and i was just like maybe i should truly sacrifice my queen for for the sake of this but uh i didn't he checked me here and I moved here, which the bot says is good. It's just good, you know? And then he attacked my bishop and I decided to go back. It says it's the best move. So, you know, I was not blundering that much. Maybe only this pawn I shouldn't have taken it and I would be actually completely fine. Um, but, you know, I'm a human, I make mistakes. So he does this and I take it. Because my plan was, hmm, how do I get this horse out of here? And I saw that he was attacking here and that if I take with my bishop, he will probably, if he was a human being of 600 rating, do not forget that if he was that, he would have just taken it with his horse. You know, he would have jumped here to, what is this, f6, and he would have taken my bishop, you know? He would have, because that's a person of 600 rating thinking. But no! No, 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 no. This person, actually a bot, actually a cheater, their engine whispered in their ear and told them, do not do that, kid, and actually play bishop to b4 and just get your bishop to safety. And I was just like, hmm, okay, my plan did not work. My plan did not work. And after this, you know, because I thought that maybe I will be able to outsmart him and make him take my bishop. And then when he played this, which is excellent move, then I started to to lose uh, my, my brain. Uh, I bit my tongue. Oh, Jesus. Oh, Jesus. But I wanted to oh my god, it hurts so bad. <laughs> I wanted to say that I started losing my brain cells because I was thinking like, is this person truly this smart? And I was like, okay, turns out they are. It turns out that I'm truly this stupid and they're truly this smart because like, wow. I was just like shocked. But you know, now that I know that this was actually played by Engine, I know that I'm not stupid at all and... Uh, that my my moves are actually okay that this person was just cheating and then I took I, I no I actually didn't take anything I just went back because I was like okay well now I do not care about this horse here so I will just go back and the bot here says this is also good and he goes here I have to sneeze wait a second no I can't you have to look at the light. Maybe that will help. No. But anyways, he moves his knight to what is this move? C3. C3 and gives me another check. And I was just like, okay, damn, let's go back, <laughs> you know, and pretend like it didn't happen. But I knew that at this point, you know, I was losing my queen because, I mean... He forked it, of course, I lost my queen, but then I could have at least get, gotten rid of this, this annoying horse. And then he plays this, which is queen to a5, and it's again another best move. Have you seen this? All of his moves are good, excellent, the best, it, it, like 700 IQ. Every single move that he makes is amazing, which is kind of sus, you know? Then he plays this, which is again another best move. And a person of 600 rating, would you truly have thought of this? Would you? And then I played this, which is a3. 
And he says this is excellent for some reason because I'm kind of, I'm like what attacking his bishop. Fine. And he comes here. Oh my god, no 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 no. I wanted to go back. Uh he comes here because I cannot take this with my with my king because his queen is literally looking here. And then I make this, this which is the best move before the best move, even though I thought while I was playing that this is like the mistake because he can just stick it with his uh, with his bishop, which he after that did. But then I took his bishop, and he says this is an inaccuracy for some reason. Why is that an inaccuracy? You're going to end up losing material after all the trades are done. Well, okay. I know, but I was losing the whole time. So what else could I have done? Should I have just let him do it? I do not know what the bot wants for me, but fine. I took that. It says this is an inaccuracy. I do not think so. Uh, oh, 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 now I see it. Because he can just take my rook. I totally d deleted this game from my memory because I just got so mad while playing this that I decided to... Uh, to to completely uh, oh my god my brain blocked <laughs> I decided to completely get rid of this memory and to completely forget about this because I would just be mad the whole day which is not good uh, so yeah he took my rook and gave me a check and then I moved here which is the best move of course because you have nowhere else to go and then he did this and of course I resigned because I was so angry and I was so mad and I was so heated up that I I just had no uh, brain cells enough left for me to continue playing this and I had no material uh, I mean I had I have two bishops one of them can't go anywhere another one barely can go anywhere uh, my rook is still at the same place as it was at the beginning of the game and I have few a few pawns and none of them are developed and my king is pretty much exposed so I decided I decided to to oh my god I want to sit like this uh, but I decided to resign because I had enough and here it says your opponent got the better of you in that game your opponent pounced on their opportunities in the opening that was well a uh, well fought middle game that your opponent got better off this gives an estimate of players rating based on a single game so based on this game chess.com gave me a rating remember i'm 600 600 i'm actually one uh they gave me a rating of 900 which is 300 points above me so that's pretty good, Good, you know, I played very, very well. And my opponent, based on this game, just this game, they're 600 as well, they gave him estimated rating of 1400. Are you kidding me? Really? Really? 1400? Of course, I mean, of course, how, how wouldn't they be? 1400 when you took an engine and played with the engine you did not play Anas Kryr that's what their that's their name Anas Kryr you did not play this the bot played this and see you can see here account is closed thank god because this person is a cheater from uh, Morocco so yeah that's it they cheated and I actually was playing pretty well as you can see here, they want to give me higher rating based on this game than I actually have. And I have middle game accuracy of 81.3, which is pretty good, especially for somebody like me who knows very, very little about chess. And I just started learning, you know. Like, I learned my first opening two days ago, which is the London system. So I have very good accuracy. Look at his accuracy. 95.5 accuracy in the middle game as somebody with 600 rating really really and in the opening he has 97.1 accuracy I have uh, what is this 
76.6, which is good, you know, I just played book most and that's it. He has, no, oh my god, 97% accuracy in the opening and 95.5 in the middle game and end game there was no end game because i resigned so so they did not analyze any of that i just i just i just don't know and see my accuracy would have gone by 8.1 if i played queen to c1 uh in that in that uh, scenario uh that we have switched up here so i would have gained 8.1 accuracy just because I would have moved my queen to c1 but I did not see that because I'm a person of rating 600 barely but this person was just thinking that you can become a grandmaster or whatever uh, using an engine did they really think that like I, I just do not understand so yeah the, their profile will click on the profile now um come on how do you do that what their account is closed so i can go there yeah probably yeah but uh but their account is closed as you can see and yeah their their rating is um 612 but it's actually here 1400 but it's actually zero because they're using an engine every single game i want to show you their um their profile jesus i want to show you uh but i can't go to the profile now huh okay i can i, I want to show you their profile because every single game see they cheated against everybody they won see this was a game against me wait here that was a game against me they won that previously so here they were probably uh playing by themselves and then they started cheating here and then they cheated the whole time they won every single game every single game they won here they have 96.3 accuracy a little bit more than they had with me so every single game when they started here every single game they won hmm, hmm, hmm. i truly wonder how so yeah this account has been closed for violating our fair play policy these rules help keep chess fair for everyone and thank you chess.com for making this person lose their account because they truly do not deserve it so let me stop my screen recording and we're back at the full screen so everyone Please, do not make the same mistake as I did, because when I played against this person, I got truly heated up and very sad and very emotionally distressed uh, because this person was beating my ass and they were just like, um, they, really, they really outsmarted me in a way, but it wasn't them, you know, you have to give, uh, give yourself some a space to, to relax and to uh be okay with even if you lose and if they were truly as a person this good i would be like congratulations but they actually cheated so now they're getting exposed on this video as well chess.com removed their profile and now this person is just bye bye so you know as snoop dogg says in their battle but i will sing this in the clean version this little fool ran up on me popping off with his homies like he was a straight g you know, ask him where I'm from while he's running up. Gang bang my set on every one of them. <laughs> Some things on the just don't change. Fools don't respect nothing but the gang bang. So yeah, um, that's how I feel about this whole play. You know, this little fool ran up on me popping off. Because I can't sing the, the, the uncensored version. Even though censored version of this song is very funny. <laughs> but yeah, everyone... Um, Okay, I can't look at this person's profile anymore. I'm disgusted. But yeah, everyone, if you like this video, make sure to give it a like and subscribe to my channel. And uh, do not be a cheater, please. Do not be like this person. It's no fun. Your account will get closed very, very fast. And you will just have a couple of games that you have won by an engine. So better if you want to 
play as an engine, play against the a bot by yourself or or I don't know just do not include other people in this and do not play rated games like this because it's pointless it's pointless your account will just get closed and there is there is um there's no point in this you know moral of the story do not cheat in any way not just in chess cheaters will always get punished so do not cheat in any any uh, way of the meaning that is my message for you today uh, thank you everyone for watching, uh, thank you for supporting me, leaving comments, liking my videos and subscribing to my channel and thank you everyone who added me on chess.com uh, and playing uh, for playing uh, chess with me and for talking with me, it is very very fun. So if you want to be friends, you can add me on chess.com, name is just like my channel name which is Zappa Zapeti. And we can be friends, we can play chess together and just do not use engine against me and everything will be fine. So yeah, thank you everyone for watching, I hope that you have a nice day, um, and now I'm just going to go and play more chess, yeah, and uh, that is it. So if you're interested in seeing more videos like this, I will be linking my chess adventures and chess reviews in the video description down below, so you can check them out as well. That is it everyone, uh, have a nice day, I think I already said it, but doesn't matter, have it twice. And